Hello everyone, welcome to automation community. So in this session, we are going to see about comparator instruction in Omron PLC. Kindly like and subscribe our YouTube channel for more updates and videos. So without any further delay, let's enter into the topic. So in the previous session, we have seen three instruction in the comparator. So one is equal and uh, the another two is less than and greater than. So in this, we are going to see about remaining three which are not equal to greater than or equal, less than or equal. So this is less than or equal. And uh, we have greater than or equal. And this is not equal also which is this one, 3 not 5. So this is the instruction number. So let's see about 305 first. Not equal. So I'm giving the address of the particular number, the first number. Okay. So we should not press enter at this stage. It should be one more number is there. No. So just type that number also, that address also, and then enter. Okay. So put it in the input side, just cut it and paste it somewhere between this input, you know, input condition and this one. So just connect this, take one output, connect the rank. So that's it go for the simulation now d0 at left side and d0 at right side i mean d0 at left side and d1 at right side in between you have to put the operator not equal correct so let's see 0 not equal to 0 is it true no right so that's what it is off so let's make the value to some other now the output is on because 1 is not equal to 0. Correct. So let's make this also to 1. Immediately this will go off. Okay. So this is not equal to instruction. So like that we have greater than and less than. So let's see that also. I am going to find out this is less than or equal. So give D0, D0 and D1, that's it and then enter, okay. So connect one of the input here, 0, 0.00 and connect one more output, 100.01. So connect these two instruction. That's it. And we are having a error here. So let's see what is that. So I think instead of D0, there is O. D O. So go to this and edit. D0 D1 that's it okay so go for the simulation so now D0 less than or equal to D1 correct now so let's turn on this now see your output is on because D0 1 that is less than or equal to 1 so there are two options it should be less than or it should be equal to so it is Satisfying in the second category equal to that's what your output is on. Okay. So now change the value to some other value and there should be a limit. See the value should be 0 to 65535. So if you give more it will not accept if it is more than that. So now both the instruction are getting passed because it is not equal to correct. One is not equal to 78. 7687. So the first output is on. Why the second output is on? Because 1 less than or equal to 
7867 because 1 is less than 7867 so output is on understand understand the difference so this is not equal to and this is less than or equal to so it is satisfying in the less than category so that's it about these two instruction and we have one more for this session which is greater than or equal this is less than and we have here it is 3 to 5 greater than or equal to so give the same address why i am giving the same addresses for better understanding so that we can compare all three so connect one new output So just connect take one more input here and just giving the same instead of turning on all three inputs separately i'm adding the same input in all the three runs so go for this simulation right so now turn on the input what an all instruction what an all output will on first two are on because this is e not equal and this is less than so 0 1 this d0 is not greater than 7867 i mean 78 7687 so your output is off so just just to change the value to 9000 now your output is on your third output is on and your first output is on because this is not equal this is greater than so let's take this is also to 900 9000 both the instruction are on because there is a equal operator here so like this you can play with this instruction in the application so i hope you have understand the concept i'll meet you in a session with another interesting topic kindly like and subscribe our channel for more updates and videos thank you